kids are supposed to expose themselves to a bunch of really yucky things so that their body has an opportunity to build defenses to it. This is how we become more resilient. So my the reason for continuing and hammering this home is that we can already think differently about how we respond when our children come to us in some sort of emotional distress. We can think our response is not, doesn't need to be just how do, what do I have to do to make you feel better? How can I support you in feeling better? It's how can you manage this feeling? How can you tolerate this feeling? How can you learn from this feeling so that you're more prepared for it in the future? That's a very important change in how we think about and respond to our children's emotional discomfort. When my children come and they're, oh, I'm anxious. My response is great. That's awesome. Let's learn from that, right? I'm not trying to take it away from them because I know that their ability to sit with it and figure it out and learn about themselves through it will make it so that they're less anxious in the future and they're better able to face difficult situations. That when our children come home and they've got a lot of homework and they're, and they're feeling really anxious and overwhelmed about it, that instead of saying, oh, what do we need to do? Let's get in touch with your teacher and get an extension or something like that. We're going to say, how do we manage this? 